Um, it's a lot of gold cards. This is good this round. These two are good this round. I think this is fine. Alright. So we go here first. Give that some some love. We get the Munros down first. Could pause oh, I don't think I can kill the Ada. It would be nice, but on a mean so And who you address? And how you address them? Go back across the Yaruga, you yes. So it's definitely like mutagenator shenanigans, right? Reavers, okay. You're one of us, so we go all out. I mean, the nice part Blood. is Blood. I could actually kill this, which is hilarious. Three good pings. Oh, so close. <laughs> so close. What else spawns? So he's able to get it down. Don't recognize your old mates. We're the Crinfred Reavers. So get that. We get a bunch of them. The question is, can we get enough to hang with these guys? Um. So we get our carryover, right? This one got kind of sad, huh? Because of all the damage. We go here, right? That's fine. We got carry over too. Can you get 30 points in two cards? And I still have this. I think he plays one more card. He passed. Okay, cool. Let's see if we can 2 0 this fool. This Reaver scum. We have the Bruver, we have the Defender. This is nice. We just need... I mean, the damage was real bad, but we lost. Alright, that's good. That's good. Um, what else could we possibly want? There's a lot of cards. I think, though, we want to get rid of this. Shaky. Shaky. He has to play the other Reaver, right? Dandelion. Are you my friend always? Anna, really? I guess she's gonna be a pretty big engine, though. Um, where do I go first? I try to kill it, right? Elven. Then we go here. Maybe we just get the Bruver down early. 
That's fine. We kill it. That's sweet. We just do it, right? Great. I think next we play the Bruver. We start getting that engine going. These come down next. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. And nine. All right. So that works. Thirty. Eldar, that's two. So he's we're matched up with him. A piece. This comes down. So we're going here with. Oh, we have to go here first. So we get our carryover. Oh shit. We have to use our thing. Somehow, how did it lose armor? So we got 43. He's getting two a turn. Regis. But we have Defender, which is huge. So he has to get a way, find a way to get through this Defender. We go here. Um, that has to go on melee. Shoot. So this goes here. This goes here. And we give this one an armor. 56. 63, we're gonna put this here. I think this is a. Because it's not, I mean, like, yeah, he's. Even if he steals the. If he gets the swap here. I guess, though, the problem is if I go here, that's free for him, so we go into the Il Uldar. So he's getting double Witchers. Okay. But we're still rolling. Ah, uh, we lost a point there. Let's give him this. Put this on... This. 80 points. And we got two rolling through. 88. The carryover was huge. Contro Dim destroys that one. Is that enough? It's 16, 74, 20 points, he gets 4 points, he's got another reset, that's 2, and the leader, that's 9, oh, he got there by 1 point, 1 point, holy cow, good game. Hey, that's the video for today, guys. A uh, short one. Let me know what you think. Um, it's I would I would compare it to a worse siege deck is what I would compare it to, because um, it's one of those things where you just have to two o them almost. It seems like, um, and it doesn't even have like the tutors. Like I could probably swap some things around, but it's like there's so many things you want and. You can't really have them <laughs> and fit all the provisions. I don't know. Maybe there's something a little bit more optimal, but uh, you guys are wonderful. Thank you so much. I'll see you next time. Hey, guys. What is up? I am Devil Driven. Uh, we tried to run some uh, Mahakam Dwarves. Uh, short video today. I got a lot of stuff to get done, but um, I just uh, wanted to throw this one out here because Dwarves was always fun back in the day they and then they were like crazy good and then they were just extremely bad <laughs> like they've had a roller coaster throughout Gwent um but uh going through the cards you know you got the Zoltans times three so that it brings out the Breckenridge at uh five um she puts that mark on a random unit it's going to be one of the three Zoltans um, it actually works out pretty good 
Um, I like it. I think it's pretty cool. Um, depending on which, you could see which card it's marked with the little, like, look at that, like, like, doomed logo on it or whatever. Um, it's kind of like purplish red. But, um, depending on what that's on, that's where she'll spawn. So if you're looking to do your Zoltan Scoundrel and maybe, you know, if you can stack on ranged, some of the abilities are melee, you know, like the resilience or there's, there's a couple, um, when you look through them, but, um, if you could find a way to add that to it when you play the scoundrel it helps out you know an extra couple points especially with dwarves uh zoltan company you know that's got m multiple uses with either the um the warrior zoltan warrior um just a really great card I i've always liked this card it was like uh the uh ramon for for dwarves um, you got the defenders. Chariots are just MVP. You got another way to spawn them here um, for the warriors, Zoltan Warrior, if you play it on ranged, which is always probably the preferred method since you want to stack a row. Mahakam Pass. Um, I like it. I, I, I wish it was nine, but... Um, it works out pretty well. It gives you a body on the board. There's a lot of, you know, decent dwarfs you could pull. The defenders, the um, the berserkers, even a guard if your rows filled up. That's another thing too. You got to be careful of with the the guards. Um, make sure you don't uh, mess your row up so that you could still squeeze him in there and get a good eleven out of it. Um, and then Bruver, just massive, absolutely massive card if it. Uh, sits there and lawnmowers through your opponent's stuff uh double carryover too as well with zoltan chive and uh gabor um upvote the list you guys have been wonderful man uh all the all the views and comments and stuff have been fantastic i'm uh i'm really happy you guys are sticking around for gwent it uh it warms my heart man because i i'm like i I don't know how many videos I'm gonna be able to put out a week. You know, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna try for like three, you know, three a week. That seems doable for me. But um, you know, sometimes there might be uh, something that you know I can uh, put out there a little bit extra. Um, every once in a while, maybe a late night stream on Twitch. We'll see. Um, it'd be later on in the evening, like uh, Sunday, Sunday or uh, Saturday night or Sunday night at like. 1 or 2 a.m. So <laughs> if you're a late night friend in uh, Eastern time in, in the U.S., so I'll, I might be on there, but uh, maybe record the content and then put it uh, put it here on YouTube. So thank you guys so much. I'll see you at the end.